Can you sense the excitement in my voice? It's a friendly, I know. It's an Old Trafford friendly, which in the past have not been fantastic, let's be honest. But I'm back at Old Trafford for the first time in what seems like an age. Last time he was there, Alfie was about four foot. He's now about eight foot tall. Last time I was there, popcorn was going in the air. We were beating, we were winning the derby 2 0 against Man City with a brilliant assist from the City goalkeeper. That's when I remember being back at Old Trafford the last time anyway, but now I'm back, finally. Alfie's back. It just feels good. I can't wait to smell the Death Burgers, the crappy hot dogs and fried onions walking into the ground, the experience, getting wound up about traffic on the way in. I've missed that. Alfie's not missed it, because all he's heard is me just ranting on, but yeah, the match day is back. The teams are in, it's a friendly, let's be honest. All I'm doing today is just getting the vibe back. The match day vlog is back, I couldn't miss this. You knew I was gonna do one of these today, guys. I cannot wait to get back in the stadium. I just wanna go through a turnstile again. Christ, it's been that long. Teams are in, who are we watching today? Well, Van der Beek and Dallow are back in the squad, both on the bench, interesting. We've got the usual uh, setup at the back, heat and starting the game. It's pretty similar to how we've gone with and the other two friendlies that we've played so far, even the one we got dicked against QPR in that weekend. But, you know what, a few of the first teamers crawling back into the squad now for training. Varane will be here soon. We know next week that the international players are all going to start coming back. So maybe in like a week's time, week and a half time, when we play Everton at home, we may actually see some first uh, first team players in there as well. And then week after, well, that's it. We're in. It's Leeds. I'll be 40. The grey beard will be even greyer. But I don't care, because football's back. Come on! We are back in the seats oh, and for the first time in what, 18 months, a word from Alfa. Yeah, so a little uh, little spoiler alert here, Alfie has turned into a teenager since we was last at Old Trafford and as everyone knows, uh, the Kevin and Perry switch switched on with Alfie and you don't get, Many words. You don't get much words, <laughs> I'm going to be while you're going forward but for real and quickly Alfie, I know you don't want to say a lot because you don't but excited to be back? Yes. Yeah, positive signs, positive signs. Score prediction. Fino. What? Fino. To Brentford? No. <laughs> We're just here to enjoy it today, get the vibe back, like I said before, and just looking forward to seeing some live football. That is it. Can't wait. But we'll see. I mean, pre season is pre season, it's all about getting fit. And like I said, I think the main stuff will start happening over next week in terms of fine-tuning things. And now we may look starting the season, but for now, I'm just going to sit here and enjoy being back at Old Trafford. I'll see you guys at half-time. Oh, by the way, there's actually Brentford fans here today as well. Away fans and home fans. Anyway, I'll see you at half-time. Back to before. First half over, mate. What are you reckoning? It's all right. Not the best. Well, it is going at a friendly pace, but if you're looking at this and you're trying to pick out, I'll probably give them a half-time sort of uh, play rating because I think there will be subs. And to me, Matic just stood out today, not just saying that for the namesake, but 
he's been a class above everyone today. Uh, Greenwood looks sharp, and Rob Bazaka looks decent as well tonight, which is good because he needs to pick up some form before the start of the season. But it just feels good to be back, to be honest, watching a game. I do feel towards the Preston and Everton games when we're really going to see some form of like. Oh, no, pushing out a bit more and knowing exactly where we're going at the start of the season but I do feel like tonight a few players looking a little bit sharp one was after in particular like I said good I'd say him Greenwood probably the only ones that really got a chance to start in the season maybe Lingard play with a game mate so far probably Matic yeah he knows man like Matic different class above so far. I think he will get subbed off now and also. It'll be interesting to see if Donny and Dallo come on. It'll be good to see Hannibal actually in the flesh as well today. And obviously a few of the other kids coming on as well now. Pellestri as well. We're looking forward to seeing him as well. So yeah, looking forward to the second half. I'll see you at the end. And we're out. Night night, Old Trafford. Oh, I think Alfie's hungry now, aren't you, mate? Yes. Yeah, starving. He's not used to it, you see. Stuck in his room on the PlayStation for so long with old football. He's got to get his body back used to the routine again. Well, uh, it was an alright game for a friendly. Two, well, I'd say three spectacular. Four, you could say. Four excellent goals. Pereira's was an absolute banger. Literally. After I slaughtered him for that poor free kick in that YouTube short video that I did, he goes and smashes one on the volley, top pins in off the bar. <laughs> Brilliant goal, I've got to say. Absolute superb finish. Uh, so were uh, Bournemouth's goal, uh, Brent Bournemouth, Brentford's goals. But to be honest, there, there goes again. You know, I can see from a set piece, keep topping them up. Our new coach, our new set piece and defensive coach has got a lot of work to do with his team, even though. None of the real defenders were in tonight, barring Bamba Zako. Heaton didn't have nothing to do but pick the ball at the back of his net. But on friendlies, you're just looking at what you can take away positive wise from it, because they really don't count. I've said this to many a people before. I've watched Van Gaal have an absolutely ridiculously awesome pre season, beating everyone under the sun. Come first game of the season, what happens? We get dicked at home by Swansea. So, pre season for me, I'm going to take it. I'm looking at players getting a bit sharper. Oh, I'm looking at players getting a chance, like the young kids that did today. There's a few decent performers, but that's all friendlies are. I think, and I just said it before, that come the uh, come the Leeds game, not sorry, come the Everton game, come the Preston game coming up, I think we'll have a better idea. A few more players will be back. A lot of the first team squad from the Euros are coming back this weekend early next week so maybe they will have a chance of getting some game time against Everton and that'll be more interesting right now all that matters is we're back at Old Trafford football is back people the fans are back 20,000 or so Old Trafford today that's all that matters that's it it's all that matters people jobs are good in and for me looking forward to next week now and then the week after that start of the season let's do it anyway people don't forget hit that like button share subscribe if you are watching for the first time there's loads coming up another match day vlog coming coming soon against everton and obviously loads more on the channel stay tuned turn on the notifications to get notified when the latest vids are coming out people had a match back at the ground alfie back at the ground he's still not saying much but people i'll see you in the week